and she's gonna get Tiana, and then um, my our flight comes back in at like 9:30 on Saturday night, so she's gonna pick us up then. Bye, Bruce. Good morning. Bye. Robin, I hope you like the airplane ride. Bye, Bye Grandma. Bye. Love ya. Love you. Take care. I'm now. more scared of the airplane ride than I am of the surgery. Yeah. I do. Uh, what do you have there? Scapio locket. Okay. Got it? Uh huh. <gasps> That's my first time getting it over by myself. Gonna hold it still. But like I said, I'm excited and scared. How scared? On a scale of one to ten. Six, seven. That's just because you freak me out about I, it. I'm only taking care of my bases. I'm just covering my bases. If I didn't cover my bases, I'd be responsible, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, if I am completely confident, does that make you more confident? Yes. Okay. All right then. <laughs> if I would have never said anything about wills or anything, how confident would you be? See you later on. Confident. You want to just wait here for a little bit and she'll text you once we go through? I'll just wait, wait in the car. Okay. Dang it. I missed it. Oh. Okay, all right. Okay, yeah, just go ahead and I'll text you then. Love you. Right. Bye. Bye, I love you. My grandma. Say hi, grandma. Hi. This is my grandpa. Say hi, grandpa. Hi. What do you think about me having the vertical gastric sleeve? May 1st. Yep. I, at first I was a little bit skeptical and... Why? Why were you skeptical? Because I was kind of thinking, uh, will this really work or is it going to be something that's going to be kind of dangerous? But then when I think about it more, I think that You've struggled all your life, ever since you was a little girl, actually, and that you've tried everything there is to try. So I'm thinking it's okay. Go ahead and do it. If it'll help you, that'll be great. Were you skeptical about me going to Mexico? A little. Not too much, though, because I've heard good things, too. So. Well, I know you've had a weight issue for a good many years. And uh, here in the past few years, here you've drawn quite concern about it. You've uh, you've tried you've tried a lot of ways of of losing and 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 has failed. It ain't a quick fix. It's it's it will help her aid her so she'll be able to get herself down. So she'll be able to do the things that she's been wanting to do, like go out and run around a little bit without getting winded and uh, and. Uh, and be able to do the things that she wants to do with her daughter. How you doing? Look at the camera, bro. Yeah, what did we do that? What did you say? Since I was young uh, and to this day, I've seen how Robin's weight has affected her. Um, as we've gotten older, I think it's affected her more. Uh, it brings her down. It, it has prevented her from doing things she wants to do. Um, it's, it's really prevented her from being who inside she is, but because of her outward appearance and how she feels physically, because of those things, it's made her not be able to really be who she is and outwardly show how awesome she is because she's so, in my opinion, she's just so embarrassed and scared. It was awful. And then, um, uh, on this next flight, they, the person put us, put John in, um, the, a middle seat and put me in a middle seat. We were not sitting together. 
No, and I was in a middle seat, and the seats were small. Like, I really want, and the guy that John, John just said, hey, would you mind maybe coming up here to move in this one? And the guy goes, absolutely not. I'm sitting right here. And then, and then he asked the other guy that was in front of him, would you mind going back there and sitting there so me and my wife can sit together? And he said, nope, I'm staying here. Well, so then I was like, I was ready to get off. I was not flying if John was not sitting beside me because I can't, I don't have enough room and John's small enough to where, and I can lean into him so it's not weird because he's my husband and I don't really want to lean into that rude guy. <laughs> so Robin, you're almost there. It's been yeah. anguishing to say the least. And you haven't done anything to lessen my stress? I haven't. Nope. <laughs> what have I done to increase your stress? Everything. Such as? You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> Are you referring to the first thing this morning? I'm talking about the entire day. You've just been in a it's yeah. poor mood. Hi folks, nice to have you with us down to San Diego. Real quick flight, 20 oh, minutes or so. We'll be at 11,000 oh, feet open for a nice smooth ride down to San oh, Diego. Oh, Clear skies await us. No oh, delays oh, expected, oh, however. We might just get a couple of minutes of uh, spacing into San Diego. But so, yeah, definitely definitely seen how the weight's affected her. Um, I've seen how many different diet plans she's been on, especially living with her, and how up, up and down those were, and uh, never really working out. And I've seen when she's been just so depressed about that, and it has affected, you know, all of us around her as well. And um, I'm all for it. And I'm excited for her. I'm nervous for her. And I'm ready for her to do it. I'm very excited. I think that uh, doing it in Mexico is just another place to get surgery. I don't think that because it's in Mexico that it's a bad idea. I think that it's a good idea. She's done her research, like I said. And when Robin does her research, she does her research. She's very thorough and she will look at hundreds of different videos and look at different sites and information to make sure that this is what she wants. Way we're going back. Really weak all of a sudden. I haven't had real food in two weeks. And today I haven't had any. Um, in the past, she has said no to certain things like this, and and I think with this, this is different. This this is different, and to me, if Robin says this is different than anything else that she's looked at or any other diet out there, if she says that this is what she wants to do, then this is what she wants to do, and I completely trust her insight and what she thinks about it so yeah are you miguel yes sir all right what a day we missed our first flight we ended up having to get a flight on delta and had to take three planes to get here wow it we was a long from day Iowa, from where so. you usually Flying. Des Moines, Iowa, and then they flew us up to Minneapolis, then to Los Angeles, and then to here. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so it was a very, very long day. I imagine. Well, from here to the border is like 20 minutes, but right now it's like, it's gonna be rush hour, so. Right. Um, maybe we're gonna do like 40 minutes. Now, no, I don't think it's gonna be that bad. Just to get your take on it, uh, I was just in Palumas about a month ago, yeah. which is a lot, lot smaller than Tijuana. But is it, is how, how, I know we need to be cautious because of all the issues going on with, with the crime and stuff, but how well, bad no, is Tijuana, it really? No, Tijuana is real safe. No, it's, don't worry, Tijuana is okay. safe. Okay. Yeah, it was, it, was, it was a lot of crime, but like eight years ago, six years ago. Okay. Right now it's real safe. It's, it's real different Tijuana because um, the cartel is no more in Tijuana. Uh, the, the cartel from Tijuana was Arellano Felix. 
and that cartel, there's no more cartel. Okay. One of the brothers are in jail, the ones are dying. Right, right. So when that happens, well, in that time when the cartel was in Tijuana, all the police that was with the cartel, it was real bad. Right. If you want to be a police officer, you just get on the office order and, and you say, okay, I want to be a police officer. Okay, give me $2,000. Here's your badge, you're a police officer. That was real bad like that. Oh, wow. Right. So there was a lot of corruption and everything. But right now, it's oh, all the police, they have they need to have the like, like, background check. They got uh, the academy, they, they have college, everything. Right. So, and the military police is mixed with the city police. Oh, okay. So they're real good. Right. And we have cameras in all the city. You have uh, you, you, and the lights, you see cameras everywhere. So they saw there's a building over there in Tijuana. It's all the building is just screens. So there's you know, police officers just right. looking over the cameras. Oh, they okay. See something wrong with the travel? They send it a real quick uh, a patrol. Right. So no, Tijuana right now is real safe. So you can walk outside the night and everything. It's much better than like five, right. six years ago. Right. This is the Holiday Inn. Let's turn some lights on. Do you want me to talk to you? Yeah, you can talk. No, you cannot talk. Go ahead and open that window. Hold on, that thing I want you to take a picture of? Mm-hmm. Where? Yes. Oh, Abraham Lincoln? Yep. Why is Abraham Lincoln over here? Because he was Mexican. He was? <laughs> okay. Never mind. Yeah, I got that recorded. Me being gullible. Yes, yes you do. You know, I think the, 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 the name of this street is Paseo Los Heroes. It's the hero's uh, street. So, over there in the back, there was a, a, another uh, statue. There's more tacos over here. You're going to see more tacos everywhere over here. Tacos, tacos, and more tacos. Tacos, tacos. Think you're gonna have some tacos? I'm gonna have some tacos. For every pound you lose on this trip, I'm gonna gain twice as many. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the silver. We, we make our own silver. Just all this genuine sterling silver, all of these. Okay. You like something, no problem. Take your time. Okay, thank you. Uh, let's Pas that's Pastor. They have a carne asada. What was the first sign? What's well, Pastor? What is that? It's pork, but it's like with adobo. Yeah. Oh, uh, I like pork. Yeah, okay. let's do that. Do you want to taste it? You want something to drink? Yeah, please. Um, what is that? Is that a squirt? This is 
Kind of squirt it. I have one of those. Is it recording? Yeah. yeah. You know what? That one. Oh man, that looks good. I'm going to the real I'm quick. I'm so jealous of you. I'm sorry. How is it? It's awesome. You like it? Oh, yeah.